aside from the idea that the the MCU should have ended and reset, which would have really opened the doors for all the possibilities that they could have done, I wish that they were leaning into the multiverse. I know people don't really like how DC is approaching a lot of stuff. It's all inconsistent and all that, but I like the fact that if you don't like the Justice League movie and that approach to Cyborg, you can go watch Doom Patrol. If you don't like the TV Flash, you can watch Justice League and the upcoming Flash movie. Uh, Deadshot also showed up in Arrow, so you don't have to watch Suicide Squad. You know, it's like the Arrowverse is the DC counter to the MCU. And you'll never convince me that the multiverse saga was not inspired by Crisis on Infinite Earths. But they've also got additional timelines established with things like Titans, who has access to everybody because it's their own world. And yes, I do like their interpretation of Bruce Wayne. I don't think the guy would do good as Batman, but as just being Bruce Wayne, I, I think he's fine. You know, I, I think he feels like an older needs to retire Bruce Wayne or needs to retire Batman, I guess. It works for me. I mean, we've got so many interpretations of Batman. It's just, you know, one that's dramatically different does not bother me. It's totally fine. We have Doom Patrol. That's in its own world. That actually isn't tied into Titans. Had the crossover in the first season, but even then they were kind of acknowledging, like, it's just to introduce the characters. The actual Doom Patrol series contradicts all of that. It's definitely not connected. And so it could use anybody it wanted to. And then you have the Arrowverse that has all of their stuff. And then you've got the movies, which technically have multiple timelines going as well. I wish Marvel had committed to doing something like that. So that we could have things like a, like a Marvel Max universe on Netflix with a new version of Black Widow. An actual Russian Black Widow showing up to interact with Punisher or someone. You know, that maybe even Captain America could have shown up in the show. A different incarnation of him. Maybe even some of the other characters, even. I, I can't immediately think of any other grounded characters that were in the movies that would have fit into, like, a darker world. But, like, they're canon with the MCU. They never contradict it. All of the shows are canon. The Netflix shows, Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D., Cloak and Dagger, even Runaways. I know people try to say that Runaways isn't because of Nico, but she's credited only in the credits. They never say her name on screen, which in any movie means, meh, they don't really exist in that movie. I don't know. 